What lads, what's the crack? My name is Orgy Runner and welcome back to Telltale's The Walking Dead. Right, I'm still a little stuck on what I have to do. The only one I didn't talk to here in the last part, or in the last video I should say, is Andy, I think? Or, Danny, Danny, yeah. Danny boy! Come here, come here I want you. I need to talk to you about something. I need to talk to you about Andy. I need your help in distracting him. Can you do that for Hello? me? Uh, you're a bit weird. You really like that girl. What's not to like? Uh, it's, I'm gonna be honest, it is creepy. Just kind of creepy, that's all. Times like these, a 243 will keep you warmer at night than any lady I ever know. Okay, Danny knows your suspicion. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too, or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. Um, okay. I don't feel too lucky, because your whole family is sus. I don't know what it is about them, but I'm like I said, I keep saying this. I, I said in the last part, in the part before, I think. You're giving me real Texas Chainsaw Massacre vibes you for some reason. Pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Jeez. You... You definitely sound creepy. You sound weird. There's something about you. To be honest, I wouldn't be surprised if they're cannibals, if they started eating other people. I, I, I don't know why. It's it's a stereotype. You know, uh, inbred uh, rednecks and whatnot. I don't mean to offend anybody, but it is a stereotype. I know it's not a real stereotype, but it's just like a, a, horror, tr a horror trope. Now, I did mess with this in the last video, but uh, I might have missed something. Oh, 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 yes. I did not do th this the last time. There you go. Can I just cut the belt? Ow, damn it. Thing is moving fast. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I have to turn it off first. That would make sense. Now I can take off the belt or cut it or whatever. There, that should do it. You do? Damn it, where'd he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a bell. Damn it, dog. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this will take forever. I'm surprised you're not suspicious of me the way I'm just hanging out here. Like, if that thing threw a belt. Surely the belt would still be inside if the little panel was closed. Alright, but either way, that should keep you busy for a few hot minutes. Kenny, how you doing? Picked up something I think could help with the lock. Nothing to stop you now. Okay, let's see this. Ah, nuts. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get back. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Jeez, Doc, you need to learn to w use your inside voice. Again, I almost tripped over my words there. Okay, come on, let's see this. Oh, 
almost there. Oh my god! Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner I did. Time. Uh, let's see if I found the door open like that. Look, I just came in and found the door open like that. Probably my idiot brother. Uh, hey, was anyone with you just now? No. Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. Yeah. I'll keep saying it. Texas Chainsaw Massacre oh, vibes. Oh, 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 it. You wow. are an angel. Oh, oh, excuse boy. us. We had to block the back door after a walk and got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mom? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Okay, I'll be sure to do that, Ma. Help! Oh, I heard that. Oh, scratches. That looks... Suspicious. Walkers aren't getting through that thing. But I suppose I should wash my hands first, shouldn't I? Or just peep through the medicine cabinet, I suppose. I could use a shave. And I suppose you could clean out your ears as well. Wait, what pet? I guess I'll never know. And if I go in here, will I hear that cry for help again? Somebody! Okay, that's probably Mike, more than likely. Quickly and quietly. Ooh! What? Creaking stairs. Okay, multiple doors. I'll guess I'll try this one first. Stains. Suspicious. Is that blood? Again, let's just peer out the window at the beautiful light sky. Getting oh. late. No sign of bandits, though. Seriously, how are they not suspicious of me yet? Plenty of medical supplies. What the hell? <gasps> A secret door, I knew it. Yeah, we got a bit of everything here. What do they need so much morphine for? I don't know, morphine addicts? Cannibal. Musty as hell. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Yeah, probably Mike, who's trapped behind that, I Ugh. assume. What is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers eat with 
this kind of stuff. Well, wouldn't they need? Okay, now let's examine the stains again. Is that blood? Oh yeah, now I can move it. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. But the question is, what's going to be awaiting us behind this door? I know something gruesome or some, something grisly. I've seen all the horror tropes and all the cliches. Oh, good God. Took off both your legs. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat dinner. Clementine. Oh, okay, he's dead now. Gotta, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Quick, quick, quick. gotten into you. He just had to stall. He could use some goddamn manners. Mark's Mark upstairs. Is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. What the hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. No, it's not. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true, Dad. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. No, you're Growing fucked up, up in the head. Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boss. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, oh no. Puke. You're all sick. Sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Imply? I'm not implying anything. I'm saying it. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways. One way or another. Like y'all. Let me grab a knife. Let me grab a knife. Nobody's going anywhere. Oh shit. We got lots of use for y'all right here. Oh my god, did I make a wrong decision? Did what I make a bad move? Fucking what? Put your fuck? guns down. We're walking you out of here. Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. Please. Oh, you took it a step too far. Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Wait, was that Mark? Or Mike? Oh, I know what happened now. He turned. Is... Someone... <gasps> Jesus. Called it. I knew that there's some Texas Chainsaw Massacre bullshit going on. Open this door, God damn it! I will knock the goddamn Dad, door down. It, it was a person. I ate meat from a person. Does that mean I'm gonna turn into? 
No, Clem, it, it, it doesn't work like that. If he would have stopped us in time! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. Okay. Ask the obvious. Okay, Clementine. They, they didn't hurt you, did they? <laughs> Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Yes, go Where's this a water? Dad, please! Okay, salt licks. We settle down! I'll, I'll rip their goddamn heads off and make you swallow them! There's gotta be something. There's Come gotta on. be something. I'm assuming maybe the ear vent? I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get. Uh, uh, oh God. Easy. Uh, oh God. Dad. <gasps> no. Dad, come on. Dad. Oh God, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. If he's dead, he's not dead. Come on, we can resuscitate him. What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lee, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you. We can bring him back. Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead. Okay, we can't kill him if he's we not can't dead. Kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not going to make it. He could. I, I... what Ben said. We gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. No, I, I, I got. I, I gotta Lee. try and help, Lily. Is he breathing at all? No, no, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn. You're putting all what? of us at risk, you son of a bitch! Bree, you're fucking worthless, Lee. <laughs> <laughs> no! I'm, I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I'm sorry, just, just after he got... Just... Right after the break hit him in the head, he, he counted sorry. five. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Okay. Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? Uh a safe place. Some place safe where no monsters can get you. We're gonna get out, right? Oh, damn straight. Way out? I'm working on it. Oh man, this sucks for Lily. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. You've got to think about saving your own life. Anything else I can say to comfort her? Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. Oof. That's. That's a sight for sore eyes. I'm sorry, Lily. 
Here, check in with little Clem again. Necessary. I just wish Clem didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. Now you know what? Might toughen her up. Who knows? Might have to end up doing something like that herself. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we've got to have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. Uh, okay. Could you kill a katja or a duck? I mean, a fairly reasonable question. But I don't really want to stir up any drama, to be honest. If we're going to survive this shit, we've got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. Okay, Kenny, you're mean. You're almost my least favorite person in this game. Anywho, let's see if we can climb out through here. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Clem? Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. Multi-tool. Yeah, you still have that, do you? Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm -mm. It's gotta be some weak spot. Not coming off that way. What about this one? It's not coming off that way. No. Okay, surely there's gotta be something lying around here. Surely. Kenny, you got anything? Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Okay. Well, I'll just ask him that question about catch or duck. Duck. Cat or catcha or duck. You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was catcha or duck? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have. No, they they need catcha. Remember, she's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. Okay, what about you, Lily? You look like you might have something handy on you. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. And you need time to clean the but blood off your face. Get out of here. We need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Okay. Let's loot the doot. Oh boy. Um, any idea which pocket he keeps us changing? Eh. Well, right is right. Huh. I still carry his wallet. Not that one. A ring. My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. Eh, yeah, because you gotta show a bit of respect. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. All right, so this might do the trick. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off.
Yeah, here we go. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. All right, all right. I, I just got to it. Jesus, keep your pants on, Kenny. Clementine can fit. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. Okay, I'll ask her if she thinks she can do this. You think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. I do when I get out. See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Oh, please be okay, Clem. Them? Oh, thank God. Are you okay? Did anyone see you? No, but there's an ant outside. Where the hell are you going? What do you care? Kenny! Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. We're good, okay? Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Okay. Stay here. Good. Take care Penny, of Lily, you're a moron. Okay? I will. Wait, what the bloody hell is in those jars? I told you there was something up with this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. It's in these. Oh, hands. You. I don't think I'm gonna be sick. I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. Well, not me. I've seen the worst of the worst. Hell, I even saw that one scene in... Uh, what was it? Uh, Bone and Tomahawk. That God, film was pretty rough. With these people? Okay, anything else? <gasps> oh, I can take a sickle. Yeah, we'll definitely need that. And I'll take the sickle as well, just for good measure. Oh, I can either take one or the other. Oh, right. I suppose that makes sense. I just want to take a candor and everything. Ooh, cattle prod. Yeah, you know what? I want that instead. Zzzt. And let's just take a quick look see in here as well. Jesus, this is where they put your people. Yeah, well, they're going to get what's coming to them. Yeah, we got to be real careful not to make any noise going out there. What the hell do you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you going to do? Walk up and grab 
his gun, good a plan as any. Well, it is a good plan, I suppose. They charge him when, when he least, least expects it. Easy does it. Easy. What are you doing outside the barn? <laughs> Just guarding the place, like you said. Sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. Not pick which one to keep and kill One to keep and kill the rest. You're not talking about duck and catch, are you? Quick, no, no, we have to do it now. Wait. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, now. Can you see? No, I can't. I want to talk to you again. We'll take him out together. I think that's the best plan. We'll take him out together. How? He doesn't know we're out. He's got to walk past us to get to the meat locker. We can take him out when his back is to us. See what he's doing now. Oh, shit. Yeah. I'm dead. No, shit. Yeah. Oh, what? Okay, I think I know what to do. Grab it! Oh, right in the right man boob. Ah! Get right! What? Oh, that's caught you. Okay, come on, leave. Let's get going. Uh, you see? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Cannibalism is not the answer! Aren't the walkers eating enough of us? You gotta keep me alive! If you kill me, the meat gets tainted! You can't eat it! You're already tainted! You ain't gonna kill me! Just like you didn't kill Jolene! You don't have what it takes! Oh, you wanna bet? <laughs> Sorry you'd see that, Clementine. Now he had it coming. Oh, no! Gotcha. Let's go. I'll keep Clementine safe. Wait, where did he go? go? Did can he take it? I hope he took it. Now I'm getting um, Amptyville Horror Signs, or... <gasps> what was that? Not Amptyville Horror Signs, but um, Vibes. Oh, 
Where's that coming from? Oh, it must be Kenny with the gun telling me where to go. Okay. Is it Kenny? screams from the barn what's going on yeah the, these people here they ain't right these people are fucking crazy i knew it i told you we couldn't trust them where is everybody what can we do to help larry's dead they chopped off mark's legs and tried to feed them to us jesus that's sick they've still got duck and katja in the house and i don't know where the fuck kenny is all right we're coming in to help no if we storm the house we'll cause a panic you two try to find a way around to the back. I'll head to the front. You got it. Come on, this way. Wait, are you sure? Yes. No. Yes. Okay, come on. Let's get these cannibal fucks. Sneak up to the house. Easier said than done. Oh, uh, I'm gonna take the boy and check around. Oh. Yes, me. Hey, it's me. Oh, she saw through my lie. Come here. Let me go. Please get back. Don't come in here. You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? Let her go, Brenda. Yeah, I'm coming in. You know you don't want to do this. Then go away and leave us be. No. No, no, no. You. Stop right there. I mean it. Let's see if we can talk her out of us. Put the gun down, bitch. No, please, I told oh. you to stop. I told you. Okay. Obviously, I had a choice, and I picked wrong. No, can't do this. Stop right there! I mean it. Okay, I've stopped. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Eh, you wouldn't. I bet the safety's still on you, rookie. Scope out my environments. Oh, uh, I see what's happening now. I think Mark is up here. Well, zombie Mark. Or Mike! I, what do you call him, Mark? He's Mike. I can just ease her towards Mike up there. Stay back! Okay, I'll keep talking. Let her go, Brenda. Please listen to him. I'll do it. Please. Okay, easy. I don't want to kill you, Lee. <gasps> what? What did I do wrong? Okay, maybe I just have to tiptoe up to her. Just very slowly, just inch my way up. That's all. Little baby steps. Because I think the game might be glitched. Maybe. Just a little step. 
Little step. Little step, little step, little step, little step. Just slowly shift my weight. Slowly. Slowly now. Ever so slowly. Okay, 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 okay. I'm not moving. I'm not moving. I'm not moving. I'm not doing nothing. Yeah. I... Oh, okay, okay. Now we got another bit of dialogue here. Please don't make this any worse. Just stop. Okay, not quite there yet, but we're getting close. I think I've I've gotten further. I just have to be very careful, very careful, because it does seem like this part of the game is a bit bugged. Or maybe it's intentional, I don't know. Maybe I did move too fast, maybe I was a little hasty. Easy, easy. Thank fuck! Oh, you son of a bitch! Andy, who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done! Now you brought it. No, calm down, calm down. Calm down? What for, huh? All we wanted was some goddamn gasoline. Nice. Gotta get it, boy. Oh, crap. Come on, kick or Lee, kick his ass. No, don't let him kick your ass. What are you trying to do? Oh, grab him! Grab him! No! No, 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 no. Not gonna happen, boy. Hot a little help. Jesus! No, 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 no! No! One wheel on him. Oh, my God, this feels so goddamn satisfying. Had enough. It's you. You just got your ass whooped. Fuck you. As soon as Dad and Mama get out here, you, you all fucked. They're both dead, boy. They're both dead. What did you do? What the fuck did you do? They got the trash. Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! You know what? I just might. Walk away. Yeah, I know. Fuck it, I will. Because you're too dangerous to keep around. I don't trust you. 
Good riddance. Jeez, have you still not cleaned the blood off your face yet? God's sake, do something about that. I guess this must be the end of the episode by now. I'd assume it is. Oh man, it was a very good episode. I, I liked it. I, I enjoyed it. Kind of cliched, but enjoyable nonetheless. Because, like I said, I love me my horror films. I love me my horror tropes. Tropes. Tropes, as I but. Even though they do hey Lee, get over I'm years, sorry for I love the motor in unattended. I never thought a laser pointer would be the thing that saved our lives. I'm glad you showed up when you did. Well, we gotta stick together. Were they really chopping up people for food? Yeah, and Clementine ate some. Oh, it's my fault. I panicked and didn't stop her. Oh. Were you guys able to salvage anything good from the dairy? Not really. St. John's took everything I had before the place got completely overrun with walkers. Oh, I was able to grab a couple of your things back while uh, Brenda wasn't looking. It doesn't work. Do you have any use for it, Doug? It's just a basic camcorder. The save lot's cheapy. Let me check it out, see if I can get it working. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. Oh, he's gonna chew me out. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? Uh... Not the same murder, Larry. You murdered Larry. Fuck you, man. You're alive because of me. Why didn't you have my back? I saved your wife and kid. No, I saved them by making sure Larry didn't kill us. I couldn't do it, Ken. Well, maybe we should stay out of each other's way for a while. Oh, come on, can they already like you? Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? Eh, I'm sorry you I'm saw sorry that. I'm sorry you had to see that, but I only did it to protect us. Because they tried to hurt us? Yes. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? What noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. That's a very white car. Okay, I'll just uh, ask them not to shoot. Don't shoot! We're here to help! Okay, approach the car slowly. Just check everything around here, just make sure that there's no traps or any bit of dialogue. No? Okay, no, I'm free to go ahead. Figures. 
Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> hmm. Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? W what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? Um. <coughs> Jeez. I mean, it, if we take it, I'll look bad to Clementine. If we don't take it, or if I decide not to take it, I'll look bad to the whole group. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. We'll survive without it. The hell we will. We'll find a way. The rest of us are taking this stuff. All right. Okay. What have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? Any electronics? Radios? Batteries? Here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Here, Clem. Want some, uh, batteries? Hey, Lee. Why are you, you know giving that her batteries? I got it working. You might want to see this. Oh, actually, I do. Oh, we were being spied on. Everybody's crazy in this world now. Uh, okay, and that brings us to the end of the episode this of Mast. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases in it's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. You're so full of bullshit! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort all this out, alright? We can sort this out! I'll tell you what we need to sort out. 
We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Okay, so the next episode looks to be a real humdinger. Oh, I got another trophy. It's not stealing if you need it. Okay. Chop David's leg off. 56% of people did that. Shot Jolene. 61% of players did that. Okay. 61% of people are psychos. Help kill Larry. 51% of players didn't help. Yeah, there's a real bit of a split there. Kill both the St. John brothers. Uh huh. You and 39 players killed both of them. Well, come on, they deserve to die. Seriously, they did. I mean, cannibalism? Nah. Not cool. Stole food from the car. 49% mm, of players did that again. Very split. It's so close to 50%. And uh, yeah, that's all the choices. Alright, so yeah, it was a pretty good episode all in all. If not very cliched, but the whole cannibalism and giving me the whole Texas Chainsaw Massacre vibes. Still very enjoyable. And to be honest, there's not much to be said about it. Again, it did feel a bit repetitive at some points. Then again, like I'm not the best judge of the game, but overall enjoyable and and I've joined the game in and of itself so far so yeah it's um it's good I, I, I like it like I never thought I'd really ever like a Telltale's series game like this so I'm very excited to get into the next part and hopefully I will have more lined up once I get back into Silent Hill 2 as well and I'll try and be a little more consistent with my content I need to do that I need to stop being lazy that's basically what I'm doing I'm being lazy I'm playing Modern Warfare 2 I'm playing Overwatch where I should be trying to focus on my channel which is something I should be doing <laughs> something I keep telling myself I should be doing but uh, yeah that's it and I'll leave it at that so guys you know what to do if you did enjoy this video by some freaking miracle be sure to give it a massive thumbs up comment favorite share and of course like always I'll see you in the next one so until next time see ya